Hi everyone, my name is Virginia Wade, and in this video, we're going to answer questions that people have been sending me on emails concerning my new book, which is Angels, Demons, Ghosts, How to Identify and Respond to Supernatural Spirits. So, the email we're going to talk about today um, Cheryl has sent an email um, question. How do you know your chakras are out of balance? And we have a whole chapter in the book about this. But to answer your question, um, we do have seven chakras, main chakras, and they can get out of balance. So how do you know? So I'll just go briefly uh, through each one. Uh, the first one would be your first chakra, which is the root or base chakra, um, which would be um, concerning the survival and your will and feeling safe or not. So if your main survival um, chakra, which um, is connected to your reproductive organs in that area of the body, uh, which is a red color. Um, if you don't feel safe, uh, you do not have a strong will, your will to live is not that strong, uh, you have all these survival issues, that means that this first chakra is weak and it needs strengthening. So to do that, you can do it through affirmations or through visualizing the red color uh, bright and beautiful in that first chakra. Uh, the affirmation, I am strong, um, I love life, I have a purpose in life, um, all my needs are fulfilled, the universe is friendly, my uh, income exceeds my bills and my expenses, um, anything to do with I feel safe in my environment, that's all connected to the first chakra. Uh, the second chakra has to do with creativity, it's a sacral chakra, and the second chakra, if you feel you're blocked and you are not creative, or you cannot express your emotions and your feelings, you have fear, then uh, your second chakra is out of balance. So you would say affirmations and visualize uh, the orange color of the second chakra, bright and beautiful. And the affirmations would be, I express my creativity perfectly um, I do not have fear, I am confident in expressing my feelings and emotions easily to others. Uh, these are some of the affirmations you can use. Now the third chakra is the solar plexus, uh, which has to do with personal power, uh, feeling um, independent, so if you feel that you're not good enough or that you're not that independent um, and you don't stand up for yourself, you're kind of afraid, you're intimidated, uh, you can't make decisions, you get confused, uh, then your third chakra is out of balance. So you can say affirmations like, I am self-confident, I am strong, um, I can go and achieve my goals that I've set for myself, I feel good about myself, I'm self-confident. Uh, that will help boost your uh, third chakra. You now your fourth chakra has to do with um, love and relationships feeling if you deserve um, love, uh, receiving and giving love, um, everything you deserve, are you worthy enough? 
Uh, do you feel good about yourself? Do you love yourself? Um, if you don't, then you have to work on your heart chakra. Um, your heart chakra is out of balance. If you feel that you do not deserve love, you feel you're not worthy enough, you don't love yourself. So you'd say affirmations, I love myself. Um, I'm self-confident. I feel good about myself. I can give and receive love easily. I am happy and um, I feel good about myself. I am worthy. I deserve the good things in life. Okay, moving on to the next chakra, which would be your throat chakra. That's self-expression. So if you're having a hard time expressing yourself, people are misunderstanding your communication, um, your creativity may be blocked. These are signs of your throat chakra um, not being balanced. It's out of balance. Um, also, the physical, um, if you have anything to do with your neck hurting or clearing your throat or throat problems, it's all because this chakra is out of balance. And that's true with all the chakras. There's a physical counterpart to each one. Um, let's move on to the, uh, the third eye or the brow uh, chakra. Um, if you're doubting your intuition, you're not sure about yourself and what you're receiving, the guidance you're receiving, that has to do with your third eye or um, brow chakra being out of balance. So accept and receive your intuition. Follow it. I receive the divine guidance. I do not have fear. I'm not blocking it. Now your crown chakra is on the top of your head. So that would uh, be your connection to the divine, to God and your higher self. Um, you're not separate. If you feel you're separate from God, you're trying to survive on your own, that nobody's helping you, um, it's all related to the crown chakra being out of balance. You need to meditate, um, listen to devotional music, attune yourself to the higher divine and God and to your higher self and receive guidance and know that um, God is there to protect you. The angels are there. The unseen is greater than the seen and will assist you in this life. If you are confident in that, then you will be able to um, balance that crown chakra. So that's basically, um, in a nutshell, uh, the different chakras and them being um, unbalanced. And then you say affirmations, um, I am one with God, I am receiving divine guidance. You know, be sure about these things. It's turning the negative into the positive, basically. So I hope you, I answered your question um, on that. Okay, that's uh, all we really have time for um, right now. Um, we'll move on to the next video, um, and I'll answer some more questions. So my name is Virginia Wade. And if you're interested and want more information or you want to look inside the book, you can always go to Amazon.com um, and then uh, put Angels, Demons, Ghosts in the books and search it, uh, Dr. Virginia Wade, and my book will come up and then you can look inside the book. Um, but if you're already reading it, which a lot of you are, um, you already have the book, but it, it is, I'm just telling, you know, for other people, uh, it is on Kindle also, and there's a lot of good information in there, but uh, you can look inside the book and see um, all the different things um, that are in there. Okay, uh, my website is www.opendoorswithin.com, and then I do have other YouTube videos, uh, Spirits and Ghost Communication, um, Psychic Attack, Spiritual Protection. Um, I have one on Gemstone and Crystal Healing. 
um, about the angels and fairies and interdimensional beings. Um, so go check it out, and I'll see you in the next video. Okay, bye-bye.